On the outside, I'm happy, but deep down on the inside, I'm sad. Because I'm trying to fund a movie, and I'm also trying to buy a flight home for the holidays so I can see my family. And I only have a hundred dollars in ones to my name. So this year, I asked Santa if he could help me out. He said he'll see what he can do, but there was no promises. Days later, I started to lose all hope. I started realizing Santa, he's probably a busy guy and he probably doesn't have any time for me. But then I decided to do this thing called praying. And all of a sudden, a miracle happened. It was a letter from the man himself. You know, Santa Claus. Alex, I made some calls and figured out a way on how you can fund your movie and buy a flight to see your family for the holidays. I found out about this contest where you literally just have to stand in a circle longer than everyone else and you'll get one hundred thousand dollars. Now, standing can be tough, so you're gonna have to train if you really want it. Get training, Alex. The date, time and address of the contest is already in your heart. Merry Christmas! <laughs> I mean, um, happy holidays. I forgot this is 2018 and everyone is offended by everything. Love, Santa. That $100,000 prize for just standing is more than enough to make the best movie ever and buy a flight home for the holidays. I really want this, so I'm gonna have to train for it. I'm gonna have to train hard. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to climb the stairs of a really high building. Do some sit-ups for my core. I need more food, because if I don't have food, I'm going to starve! Because <laughs> I'm a stomach. I'm a stomach. And I also jogged. Remember that hundred dollars in ones I told you about earlier? I said in my last vlog that I was going to invest that money, and that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to buy a brand new pair of shoes with it. These puppies should help me stand for days. Or should I say reindeers? Because it's the holiday season, and Santa has reindeer, not puppies. Anyway, I need to get some sleep, because tomorrow's the big competition. Now it's time for the competition. I'm gonna have to pamper my legs and make sure they're always happy because I'm gonna be standing for a long time. And every hour in this competition, a pound of weight is gonna be added to a weight vest on me and everybody else too. I've gone through the stress of making the greatest commercial in the world. So this should be a piece of cake. Or should I say gingerbread house? Because it's the holiday season? <laughs> Anyway, I have to focus, and I can't let anyone get in my head. As hours pass, half the group left. If any of us had to pee, we peed in a bucket. If any of us had to poop, we pooped in a bucket inside a tent. But if we wanted to flirt, we would poop outside the tent. <laughs> in a bucket, of course. It became morning, and I gazed at the sun and gathered all its energy. I played the drums like a pro, and I ate like a king. I was eating bread. Jesus eats bread. He's a king. About 30 to 31 hours into the competition, my opponents tried getting into my head. But they didn't. They got into my heart. And I made a deal to split the prize money four ways to make a happy Christmas ending. You might see five people, but the person on the left was really just an angel helping me go further. Not only did I get enough money to fund my movie, but I got to buy a flight to see my family for Christmas. Merry Christmas, everybody and a happy, happy new year. I added an extra happy because I want you to be extra happy this coming year, because you deserve it.